Hi there, Troy here from Green Dragon Technology. Today I'm going to show you how to use Launchy. Launchy is a very quick and easy way to open up applications. It's been around quite a while since the XP days. Um, I find it a lot easier to use Launchy than to go to start all programs or all apps and try to look for something. Uh, I'll admit that in Windows 10 it's gotten a little bit easier using the Cortana search features but uh, this is something that I've gotten used to and it's still super quick and easy and it's got some other neat tools in there as well. Uh, so to get Launchy you can go to launchy.net or what I like to do, um, it's a little bit easier and faster sometimes just to go to uh, ninite.com it's a uh, website I've been using for years. Uh, they've got a bunch of freeware on here that makes it very easy to install things. You can select multiple items at once. Uh, you don't have to worry about uh, which version of Windows you have. It's 32-bit or 64-bit. There's no adware, malware, or anything else. It's very clean. You don't have to hit I agree, next, 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 finish. All these things uh, just download and install very quickly and very easily. So uh, if you look under Utilities, you'll find Launchy right here. So I just click on it and click get your nine night and it should automatically start trying to download it and I'll just hit run yes okay so now it's downloading launchy installing launchy finished close that out so let's go ahead and open that up and uh, it's going to initially start to build the catalog of uh, all the applications you have in your system here. Um, the first thing I want to show you is uh, you can change the skin on this. There's a bunch of skins out there you can find. You can go to their website and find some more. Um, I like some of the ones that are embedded in here anyway. So I'm going to click on the, uh, the gear icon. That's the options. And there's a couple of uh, things I want to change. First, like I said, I want to change the skin. So I'm going to click on skin. And you'll see there's the black glass, the default one, the mercury, the note, Quicksilver 2, Spotlight Wide. Uh, personally, I like the black glass. Um, so let me go back to general. And I like to hide Launchy when it's not in focus. So I'm going to go ahead and check that. And that's about the only thing I really need to change. I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. And there it is. Now, so now if I click out of it, it's going to go away. Now to bring it up, this is the beauty of it, I don't have to click on Launchy, I can just hit Alt Space on the keyboard and it brings it right up. So I don't even need this icon anymore, I can just go ahead and delete that. So again, Alt Space, um, like I said, uh, the catalog rebuilds every 10 uh, minutes or so. I want to go ahead and force that, I'm going to right click in here and hit Rebuild Catalog. And as soon as that gets done, great. It, what it did is it scans the entire system for all your programs and now it knows uh, what programs you have in your system. So. For example, I'm working, I want to open up Google Chrome, I know I've already got that installed. I can just hit Alt Space, type in the word Chrome, and there it is. Hit Enter, it brings it right up for me. Um, let's say I want to open up Notepad, Alt Space, Notepad, oh, there it is. Enter, brings it right up for me. Um, and here's a neat little trick, I want to uh, say I quickly want to use a calculator feature. Where's my calculator? Where's my calculator? I can type alt space. I don't even have to type in calculator. I can start typing numbers in here. 5 times 8 and it tells me right there is 40. So it's already doing simple math for me. Uh, plus 6. There's 46. So uh, just some really cool uh, little tips in there. Um, like I said, I've been using Launchy for years. Uh, it's quick, painless, easy. Uh, it's just an easy way to open up your applications. Hope you find this beneficial. Don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you so much.